Hello everyone, in today's video we are taking a look at Tesla charts. We will investigate what the price was doing in the last week and I will give you some of my predictions for the next week. So as we can see this week it was in a bit of a downtrend. Price opened up lower than the closing price on Friday and it dropped all the way down to the support. Then there was a lot of buyers so it went up a little bit again but didn't held up and went down to the support again and now it's staying just under the support so it will be very interesting what's gonna happen in this week but let me zoom out a little bit first because if we look at it from afar we can see that these supports are very significant they went all the way from 2019 so breaking these supports would be very significant as well however I managed to find another support which goes all the way from the April of 2020 so I think that even if it manages to break the support, which would also meant breaking the 100 day moving average, this, that's the red line over here, it would probably catch on the support and stay still in some kind of a bull channel. I think the price around 700 is very intriguing, so there are many buyers still, considering the great outlook for the Tesla company in the next few years. For example, ARK Invest just bought another 171 million worth of Tesla shares last week so they are very bullish and this price around 700 is very interesting in their opinion. I think they are really good at those calculations about its Tesla future price so I think that's a good sign for the Tesla stock as well. They now hold over 0.5% of all the Tesla shares which is actually 6.6% of all the ARK invest funds. So I think the price today is just a good opportunity to buy more shares if you are bullish on Tesla. But looking on the charts again, this would hold up if the market was overall positive or bullish. Then we could see maybe hanging on this lower side of the channel and reaching again the price around 900. If it was a little bit weaker, maybe we would be catched by this support in the end. But if there is some market-wide weakness in the stocks, there is still a possibility that these supports would be broken and it could fall down all the way around this 450 or 500 dollar mark which is quite strong as well it was very hard to break this line in the august to november period so if there was some kind of a bigger correction in the market i think it would fall to around these levels this would obviously mean that the tesla stock would get out of this bullish channel however i think it's not the end of the day because the fundamentals of the Tesla are still super strong. Now if we take another look using the Fibonacci extension feature, we can get from the previous bull run up until the September. If we extend it sideways, we can see that it recently broke out this level of 1.618, which was around the 750, 760 dollar mark. So we just break this, this line and we are now in this zone, which is still pretty reasonable in my opinion and there is a high chance that it will bounce off those levels and go up again maybe go into this red zone so there is good potential to reach the $1,000 per Tesla in the next few months obviously if the trend the stock market remains a bit bullish however if it would start breaking this level of 618 I think there is a high chance it would just blast through all of these and went back down to this level of 450 to 500 as I talked about previously finally if we take a look at the Fibonacci extension with the latest bull run and extend it considering the last drop which would mean that the drop is in this red zone we could then project some theoretical prices in the future so if the trend stays bullish I think there is a high chance it will bounce off of these levels and go all the way to this blue zone or even maybe to the red zone if there is a lot of optimism but we still need to remember there is this strong channel over here which is currently including the Tesla price today so from 
from this point I think there is still chance to remain in this bullish channel and bounce off of the support and remain Tesla stock price in this bullish channel for the next few months. However, after reaching around the thousand dollars per share, I would be a little bit more careful because if we zoom out a little bit and take a look at this channel in the future, it would mean that at, by the end of this year 2021, it would be around four to five thousand US dollars per share, which I think it's kind of crazy. I might be wrong, which would be great for all the sh Tesla shareholders. But I think it has to come out of this channel eventually and start to go a little bit sideways otherwise it's gonna get real crazy. So in conclusion what I think is that it will bounce off the support line which is also very close to the 100 day moving average which is very strong so I see it bounce out of this and continue in the uptrend so then this would be a great buying opportunity however if there is a big weakness in the market in general I think there is possibility to crossing this 100 day moving average and moving towards the support or even break down lower so I wouldn't go all in now just add a few shares if you you have the means to do so again based also on the ARK invest buy of 170 million US dollars worth of Tesla share last week it's a good sign and if we would measure the bigger drop if there was some market correction all the way to this 450 level it would be around 50% so that's pretty significant drop and at this point I would consider really buying heavy at these levels so in the end i think this week will be very important to watch the tesla stock it will be very crucial for the next development if we break this line and the 100 day moving average it could mean a lot of new development for the price in the next few months so watch it carefully this week i hope you got some alternative view on the stock price if so please smash the like button to help me with the algorithm and consider subscribing for more tesla content to come in the future and with this i thank you for watching and i will see you in the next video Cheers!